Hi, this is the BITE study for Warwick University and Nottingham University. This is me eating product B for the BITE study trial. And for my first meal, what I've actually done is I've used some leftover vegetable soup that I made, which obviously I added some Caribbean jerky and barbecue um, spices. And I also have some gammon. Now, it didn't look very appetising to start off with because it was quite brown. It's probably due to the oxygenisation of the vegetables. And so what I've done is I've mixed pod product B in now with my meal. And so I'm just going to try it to um, so you can see what it tastes like. Mmm. And that actually tastes really nice. And what I have not done with this product is add any cheese. So at the moment, this is the first meal that I've actually had with um, product B. Where I've not actually had cheese to the actual meal to make the product more palatable. I think one of the reasons for this is because in this product, sorry, in this meal that I've added the product to, there's a lot of salt and obviously um, flavours that are managing to mask the actual taste of the product when you try it on its own. So, I mean, I've got some gammon here. Again, you could always try corn or if you're vegetarian or vegan, you don't always have to have meat. I mean, there are a lot of um, vegan products out there like tofu that you could possibly try it with. And again, if I just put a little bit on there and again all I can really taste is the gammon because with gammon it's a very salty meat so again it's the salt that's kind of helping to mask the taste now I don't generally add a lot of seasoning to my food I tend to eat it quite bland so again I think seasoning like I've said before is going to be the key if people are going to be asked to take this product and it not be in a capsule supplement format so I'm going to go finish my meal and then again tomorrow morning I will try the product again for the first time and that will be day two of week one